Well, good afternoon. Uh, we kind of um, feel all your your answers too, but at the beginning we recognize that the food and beverage industry is the second largest uh, CO2 emissions industry of the world. And we were talking about the recognition of the sustainable agriculture that we that we recognize is very important to promote it, but also about to promote a sustainable agriculture, defining what it means. We know that sustainable have to impact the economic, the social, and the environmental fields. So agriculture, to, to be called sustainable, also have to have that impact in the three fields. We use examples for, we know about the soha. Soha maybe had, had a great economic impact, but not into the environmental. So maybe it's not considered a sustainable agriculture. The idea that we promote is that the sustainable agriculture have to come from trees. And in that part, I use an example that what we are doing in the Dominican Republic. The idea of the trees is that if we promote food and beverage, that it main um, raw material is the, 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 the fruit of big trees, we can assure our forestation in the long term. But also, we can assure it that a sustainable way of, way, of, way of life in the rural side for that um, farmers, in a way to say it. So at the end, we, we decide to give the answers First, beginning uh, with, the, with the third question. What we commit to do. And it says, based on our actual footprint, water and CO2, we commit to reduce our emissions of CO2 in a 20% to 20, uh, 2020, including our supply chains for that uh, goal. And to create a sustainable use of the water based on our direct agriculture and, pro and operations. That's our response. The second is to create a framework of incentive for research and development, savings and value change that fits all different kind of countries, but also business. It's like uh, we have to create a uh, a kind of clothes that fits different countries with different economic situations and social situations, but also inside of each country, we have different kind of businesses that the idea that we have to promote have to fix. And the last one, that is the first one. We hope that Cancun deliver and engage the governments in the sustainable long-term approach and define the need of incentive by governments directed to the focus areas for a sustainable, for a fair sustainable development. And I would like to repeat it. Engage the governments in the sustainable long-term approach and define the need of incentive by governments directed to the focus areas for a fair sustainable development. If any of the members of the group would like to add something. Well, thank you very much. And thank you very much. Um, thank, thank all of you. If you don't mind, I have just a few clarifying questions before I let everybody escape and then I'm left on my own. 